what the heck is going on here? Well, a Nissan Frontier appeared. Uh. Actually, it's been here for nine months now. Frontier's been in the family for nine months. I've loved these things. I mean, I've always liked Nissan trucks. I've got a couple Pathfinders, a couple Titans. I drove a Frontier to Seattle in 2021 for my sister. Um, I've loved this redesigned Frontier ever since it came out. Uh, nine months ago, last fall, uh, I was joking with my wife that I was going to trade my Jeep in for a Frontier. And we went and looked at one when we were out one day. We were with her in her compass, her Jeep compass, and this one, looked at this one, and she, she fell in love with it. Crazy story. That never happened. She's not a car person. Um, so that day we traded her compass in and now her 2018 Jeep Compass has become a 2022 Frontier. Am I sad about having two trucks in my garage? No, not at all. I don't know uh, really what else there's to say about it. I've meant to do an intro video for a while because I don't know, maybe other people are interested in the new Frontiers too and I can answer any questions anybody might have. Um, she will not let me take it on any adventure. She said I can't touch it, I can't lift it, I can't put new tires on it, I can't take it off-roading. If it gets scratched, I'm murdered. So this is unfortunately a Po 4X that's not going to leave Lincoln, Nebraska. Unless we're driving to visit somebody. Po 4X, absolute overkill for that. Uh, but she liked the color. She wanted this color and this is a Pro 4X exclusive color. So this is what we got. Again, am I sad? Not at all. Jeep's right there. Frontier's right here. Yeah. Welcome to the family, Pro 4X. Maybe someday she'll let me touch you. Oh, touching. Not supposed to be touching. Back away slowly. Love the front end on this new Frontier. It's aggressive. Those LED headlights look fantastic. I think these are great for factory wheels. I think Nissan knocked it out of the park with the new Frontier. I do not like the look of the new Tacoma, unfortunately. I don't even like the new Ranger. I think the old Ranger looked better on the outside than the new Ranger that's coming out soon. Obviously the current Ranger looks terrible on the inside, but the outside's a nice cute, cute little truck. Jeep, Jeep Gladiator Nissan Frontier. Best friends. Quick interior. I don't know if we're gonna call it a tour, if anybody's interested, but the steering wheel's got all the controls on it. We got Traditional gauges left and right with an LCD in the middle. Got some fun off roady pages in here somewhere. Yeah, look at that. Seventeen point four mix of in town and highway. Eh, I mean it's a truck V6. Not fantastic, but could be worse. Speed limit sign thing's fun. I'm surprised how much I like that little feature. Got a decently scry decently scryzed, decent sized touchscreen. Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, of course. I do really like the uh, kind of mix of traditional buttons and little displays down here. These are clearly the exact same buttons in the old Frontier, the old Nissan vehicles, but I think that's fun. I like I like the mix of the two. Sorry about the glare. It's evening, sun's coming down on me. Of course the wife's got all her fun <laughs> stuffed animals and knitting things in here, so it's kind of goofy in here with the knitting stuff in the off-road truck. I love the orange, they call it lava red. I love the orange stitching on this Pro 4X. I think it looks fantastic. What else is there to show you? I don't know. 
the uh here we go the button i'm the most jealous of we got a rear locker jeep my jeep does not have that sorry girl i know you've got that limited slip but it's not the same thing as a push button so yeah that's the inside oh i forgot to point out the uh wireless charger which works great for my Google Pixel 6 pulling into the garage here these surround view cameras super helpful that is too far in perfect